Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So, you might have noticed that I have a new background. Oh. Um, I've only got this one kind of set up. I forgot that you can actually see the top, so I need to set that up as well. But it's just like that at the moment. And then I'm going to have all my palettes here, but I really don't know how to set them out. I really need a palette organizer. But yeah, hi new background, how are ya? Um, in today's video, we are going to be looking at the mystery box. So I got the premium one, which was the middle one with five mystery items. And yeah, that's basically what I'll be doing in today's video. If you are new here, hi, my name is Literally Lewis and I'm based in Adelaide, Australia. I've just moved, I'm very excited. Um, I'm so much happier, Sam's so much happier in this new place. But yeah, let's get, let's just see what's inside my box because I just want to know. Oh my god. Okay, okay. So here is the mystery box. The other side has my address. So I'm not going to show you that unless Jeffrey wants to know where to send PR. <laughs> um, so yeah, it comes in a green, neon green. I love it. I'm going to keep the box. I keep everything. I keep all the packaging and take photos with them because I'm obsessed. <laughs> um, but yeah, it comes in a green packaging, just like in a really hard to open box apparently <laughs> so i'm just gonna open this while i'm opening this this is my second yep yeah, second mystery box from him i got the valentine's one last no i got i got i got both of them so i got the first one that he did and then i did get the val no i skipped the valentine's one which i'm really annoyed about because the can't relate maroon shirt was in there and i really wanted that but oh well and I really wanted the shirt from this one, but I got the yeah, smaller box. So, oh well. Next time I'm going to just get the big box because I want the shirt. Like, I really, <laughs> I love merch. Anyway, I've got the box open. I'm just going to... Oh. Right. Oh, it's still a mystery. Still green packaging, which I love. I love green packaging. Okay. The unveiling in three, two, one. We have a pop socket, we have the mystery shade, we have a liquid frost, and then we also have another below liquid lipstick. Okay, so, I know these are really popular, I don't use them, so I'm just going to sell it. I already know someone to sell it to, but yeah, you get a pop socket, that's what it looks like. It's an orange, it would be cool if it was like a neon orange, but it's just like a basic orange like same in, same as in the jawbreaker palette i use a jawbreaker for this look by the way and i'm wearing medusa as well yeah medusa from the blue bundle okay so we got a bullet and it is in the shade celebrity skin i'm gonna have to do that little hand beauty guru thing so you can see oh my god um so yeah this was the first shade we got and i absolutely love the velour liquid lipstick in this but I don't really use these bullets, but I do like to take pictures of them. So that's what it looks like. And then the shade inside is a really nice like brownie nude. So that's what it looks like. I'm not going to swatch them in case I want to like put them in a giveaway. So yeah, that is Celebrity Skin. Love that. Okay, so next we have Doll Part. I think this is a pink, so I think I might sell this or put it in the giveaway. So this is Doll Parts. It just comes in the normal pink packaging. I'll get it out and show you the colour, but I don't think I'll be using this. I think this comes in the red bundle. Oh, wait. This is, like, kind of more purple than I thought. So that's what Doll Parts looks like. Um, actually, I think I might wear this. Oh, I'm going to keep that. Um, I thought that was, like, the pinky one. I don't know why, but, yeah. That's the second shade. Then the third shade is the mystery shade. Now, it's just called question mark. And I'm scared because in some pictures it looks peachy and in some pictures it looks pinky. But by this, it looks peachy. So like Nathan kind of, if I could describe like the top of the lid, but like I'm gonna open it up and let's see. Don't wanna damage the box. Thank you. Okay, so this is what it looks like. This is the mystery shade. Um, okay, so it's definitely more pink based, but I don't know. Let me put it next to fully nude because I thought fully nude wouldn't suit me, but it kind of does. Oh, okay. 
So yeah, this is fully nude, and then this is question mark. Um, I don't know how I feel about it. I'm going to be completely honest. I don't know if I like it or not. Um, and I don't know if I want to wear it and then, like, it be used and not be able to sell it. So, yeah, I'm a bit on the fence with this shade because it's nice, but I just don't like pink tones. I don't wear pink tones. That's just not me. But it is really pretty and I love that he's done the neon packaging again. I might just keep it just because it's in the neon packaging. Okay, next, moving on. I'm a bit disappointed, not going to lie, with that shade. But moving on, we have Crown Jewels in the Liquid Frost. Um, I'm pretty sure this is like really yellow or like really dark. So it's not going to be well for my skin tone, I don't think. But Halloween is around the corner and I could use it for that. Oh wow, okay, um, yeah, it's very, it's very not going to suit my skin tone, like I can already tell in the bottle. Actually, I think this could be good for like, um, putting all over your skin just to make your skin like look tan and glowy, but other than that, I don't really know what I would use it for. Let me just, yeah, it's like really, what does it smell like? Oh, it just smells like liquid frost. I'm just going to put some on the back of my thumb and see what we look like. Yeah. Actually, when you shear it out, it's not too bad, but I feel like when it catches the light, you can't even see it. When it catches the light, it'll give you that like cast and the shadow that you just don't want when you wear a highlight. I guess it's nice, but like it's not my cup of tea. Okay, so I'm kind of happy, kind of not happy. <laughs> I mean, this is the thing with Mystery Box, you don't know what you're going to get. So, I like that I got um, Doll Parts. I actually really like that shade. And I like Chris Celebrity Skin. Um, I just, I never wear the bullets, so I usually wear um, the Velour Liquid Lipsticks. This, the, the Mystery Shade, I'm still really unsure about. Um, and this, I guess, would come in handy, but... It's not my favourite out of the ones that he's released. I would have loved a blue one. I loved all the blue ones. I really want to get more. Um, and then the pop socket. I was really hoping I'd get a straw, but oh well. I'm... It's like 50-50. I'm happy and I'm like, oh, okay. But I can put stuff in my giveaway. I really want to get a giveaway sorted for when I reach 1k on here. So yeah, I'm like putting like a few things. Away. I've got mint condition. I've got some makeup revolution stuff that I've never used. I just want it all to be untouched and yeah, that will go live soonish. Like maybe when I reach like 900 on here or 950, like when we're getting close to the 1k mark on here, I'll start like doing a giveaway and that'll be over on my Instagram, which is literallylewis2.0 if you'd like to follow. But yeah, that is it what we got in our mystery box. What did you guys get? I saw some really good ones, like with the rainbow scrub. Someone got money honey. Um, obviously everyone gets a pop socket. I really don't like how that's like one item. Like I'd rather a lipstick than a pop socket, if you know what I mean. Like, I know that they're popular, but like, I know that a lot of people are like, wow, well, I don't want a pop socket. Like I've already got them. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy. And I think... Um, I, I think I'm always going to get like a mystery box because my collection is forever growing anyway and I don't mind if I get duplicates because I'll just put them in giveaways or sell them. But yeah, I also accidentally put allegedly in my basket and ordered that by accident because I was just seeing like how much shipping would be if for the mystery box but I forgot to take out allegedly so I got that and that's a beautiful shade. If you haven't seen allegedly, this is what it looks like. It's like a really nice peachy it's more like a uh orange tone nathan if you have nathan um i'd say it's like more of a orange tone nathan but yeah guys that is it for my first video with my new background Aww. i'm so happy it looks really cool hopefully it doesn't like focus on the background and not me i would literally love if you give it a massive thumbs up down below if you enjoyed i would love if you comment down below what you got if you got a mystery box are you still waiting I knew mine, I know, I knew mine would take a while because I had to change my address because I put the wrong address initially, so I had to change it. So that's why it took longer than everyone else's, but I have noticed that people are still waiting for this, so I'm not sure if everyone's got theirs yet. 
but yeah that is my mystery box um if you have any suggestions let me know down below as well and if you haven't already i would literally love if you would join the Lou crew and subscribe like i said i'm trying to reach 1k and once i do i will be doing a giveaway over on my instagram i'll announce it on here as well so yeah that is basically it for the video guys i really hope that you enjoyed and i will see you in the next one bye Thank you.